But welcome back, folks. Welcome back to Let's Play Duke Nukem 3D. Welcome to Episode 2, Lunar Apocalypse. Let's rock. Let's rock. So this level basically does not take place on Earth. We are flying high in space. Nobody steals our chicks and lives. Just be careful of that cruiser that's flying around on the outside, because it will shoot at you. RPG! Nice! Steroids, always good. Now I'm giving this level time to load, because there are a lot of effects for it to load. Trust me, trust me, trust me. Die, ugly. Oh, got a shotgun there, though. Didn't realise I got that. Okay, it's Lunar Apocalypse, folks. We are based on... Is it Polaris Station? Polaris Outpost. This is one of the Earth Defence League outposts. Die. Do you mind not dying? Die, scumbags. See, it's got a lot to load, folks, so it is a bit glitchy, but trust me, once it's sort of got going, it'll be fine. Come on. It's just got a hell of a lot of things to load. But it looks like it's getting there. Die. Dush, dush. Shotgun shells. Now we'll meet some new enemies here. These things, I think, are called enforcers. I could be wrong. They basically replace the pig cops. So they're not particularly that strong. They're a bit more deadly than pig cops. Only because... The pig cops are kinda easier to dodge. Because these guys have got rapid fire, they can hit you more often. But they're still not too bad to take care of. How do we use that? Ah, we use it up here, don't we? Hello. Go lick. They still take two shotgun shells, so they're really not that great. Just remember, need to set up my quick save slot. Come here, ugly. Where did you land? Idiot, I think he jumped down there. Ha <laughs> ha! Time to go boom boom! Told ya. Try. Oh, I hate that bloody spit thing they do. They don't use it very often, but when they do, it's a right pain. Right. Now, which... Ah, there's the right combination. And that should have disabled that force field. And yes, it did. Grab the jetpack. Ah, that idiot fell in the water. Oh, it leads back down here. Oh, never mind. Oh my god, did I just get killed there? That was bull crud. That was total bull crud. Pfft. Idiots. How dare they kill me? They know who I am. Idiots. Hail to the king, baby. Absolute blooming idiots. <clears throat> the good thing is we're picking up a lot of uh, chain gun ammo, but we've got no chain gun. 
as of yet. Gotcha. Oh, Devastator, though. That ain't bad. So we've got a red key card. Now, where do we use that? I do use this gun occasionally, folks, only because... Ow. Ah, now that's good. Chain gun cannon acquired. Hmm, anything up there? No, nothing. What the hell? Oh, we found a secret. I didn't know about this one. Nice, and a shrink ray. What a good little find. Come on, get me in that damn hole. That's what she said. Oh, I'm rolling back here. Okay. Oh no, you're not getting me, you big idiot. Those things are the bane of my existence in these levels. They basically, all they do is just charge straight towards you and try and explode on impact, doing a lot of damage. Either way, we're out of here. Nice, got a new record as well. Missed two secrets, though. Can't think where they'd be. Oh, now Incubate is a horrible level. And by horrible, I mean horrible. Do not let those things get close to you. Where the hell am I getting shot from there? Ah, there. Sorted you out. Another one binds the dust. Now where's that one room that's always a right pain? <coughs> oh, fuzz. My bloody luck. I couldn't remember where those things came from. I hate them with a bloody vengeance. Die. <clears throat> Lots of flashing lights, so if you epileptic, walk away now. Laser trip bombs. Useless. I hate it when he gives us them. Nice try, boys. I got you. Now the chain gun and two atomic hells. Let's see if I can do it. Oh, those damn things! They are so blooming annoying. Die. Now, there's lots of horrible noises coming this way, folks. That is because there are more naked women to kill that have been, well, it's called infected. And that basically means that these aliens are using them for breeding purposes. So again, it's a kind of compliment to you ladies. That the aliens of the world want to breed with you. Strange, strange idea. But we're going to save you from that. Do not worry. Just in Duke's mighty words, leave our chicks alone. 
Now you can see she's tied up. Nothing's on show. But the easiest way to think of that lady down there is very well endowed, shall we say. So I'm not going to show her too close. Oh God. For obvious reasons. Okay, we need a yellow keycard. That is what we are missing. There is the keycard. Open says me. Got it, I didn't think that I'd get that turret, but it did. What did that do, if anything? Now oh, there's more women to kill here, I'm afraid, folks. Look, you mind? Get out of the sky. There is so much of this area that's been infected. By the looks of it, the aliens have come here. Taken the women as hostages and, well, breeders, I suppose. Killed all the staff. And now it's up to me to clear this fuzzing place out. You suck, aliens. Do not think any of you are going to survive. I'm afraid I've got to kill that lady over there too. Because she is one of the few exceptions, folks, that is actually fully new. Can't even hit him to save my life. That's one turret we need to take out. There's a turret up there. Boom, and we're done. Bitch. Come on, Mr. Brain Boy. Come back down here. Are you there? Oh, how close. Two for one deal. Get in. Oh, that was a right shot. I rock with these things. Nice, devastator weapon. Eat my pipe. That is what he said. Might as well use pipe bombs, to be honest. You don't really use them very often. Die, ugly green thing. You know, I never understand right how them things always survive a full pipe bomb blast. Because they can't survive an RPG. So why can they survive that? Little oh, sods. Sit down. Oh no, you're not getting me, bud. Oh, fuzz, not two of them. Oh, nearly. Nearly. Oh, you fuzzwit! You mother fuzzwit. Mother fuzzwit. Nothing else to take? I don't think there is. So, oh, hold on. What's up there? Ah, pipe bomb. Nice. We're out of here.
Nice, and the new record. I'm improving. God, five secrets on that level. Let's rock. I can't think where they'd be. Ah, now, what factor? There's some interesting stuff on this level, secrets-wise. And the clue... Oh, fuzz, I got hit by the back one then, didn't I? Damn it. Now, the clue is in the name of this one, folks. Warp Factor. Oh. oh, fuzz, 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 fuzz. Why'd the elevator die? Damn it. Oh, hello, Atomic Elf. I will take you. Ah, blue key card, so I had to come this way. Come get some. Come get some. Get out of the sky. Die. That rhymed, and I'm a poet, and I did not know it. Oh, I can hear them bloody exploding things. Oh, they all gone. They might have all gone, I might be lucky. I'll risk it, you know, folks. I think they've... Oh, me and my big mouth. I think they've all... Boom. Well played, Richard. Well fuzzing played. I assume we have to go down this lift now. Now, don't advance there, folks. As you can see, for obvious reasons, there are laser trip wires. Oh, it was daft on me, but I couldn't see any other way of clearing that. Health. Yeah, I recovered that quick enough. Right, we could go this way. Let's go this way first. Thanks for that. Thanks a lot for that, mates. If it didn't work out what happened there, I got crushed by a door. Yes, a door defeated Duke Nukem. Stupid doors. Although, at least those two didn't get me that time. That was an improvement. Did that get all of them? Hey, that's good. I'm actually doing better then than I was before. God, that is a nasty bit of damage you take from that. Who wants some? Who wants some? Not me, thank you. I'm quite full. Oh, forgot the blue keycard. Blue keycard, come to me. Open says me. RPG for me. And you're dead. I'm going to save here, because I'm going to try. Ah! Did they trigger it? Ah, they triggered it. Idiots. Ah, now you're not going to crush me this time, you little sod. Ha! Ah. No crushing for Necro. Now, this is one of the only corridors where night vision is actually fairly useful. It's so bloody dark, you can't see anything anyway. Nice, bit of devastator ammo there. Ah, 
Oh, that close. That was really... I didn't see that one. Where'd he go? I think he glitched into a wall. Little cheater. And across we go. Alright, there's an enemy waiting for me. Not anymore, there isn't. You're not getting me today, you stupid exploding thing. Ah no, see, nice try. I hate those things with such a vengeance, you know. Grab the yellow keycard. Don't know why my voice raised suddenly then. Should be a little secret down here. Three atomic health. Yes, three atomic healths. Just what the doctor ordered. Ooh. Ooh. Still got me with the explosion, but didn't hit me too bad. Okay, back to the other area. Why not spawning behind me? It's not very nice. And in front of me, how dare you? Now the yellow keycard gets us into the central area of this place. Oh, you fuzzle it. Ah, see? Couldn't get me with that one, could you? Douchebag. You're dead. And we have a map. Joe Doban Orbit Univ Delta Sol Moon Walk 9 blah blah blah. In it must be Super Uga. What? Stop talking out of your bum. Oh, hello, secret. Who wants some? Who wants some? I'll tell you who wants some. That idiot. That is a mini battle lord, folks. Oops, I'm gonna reload that because I screwed up. You tell him, Duke. Basically, that's just a mini version of the boss from the first scenario. Die. I don't know why I just keep saying die in the... Oh, now these guys are annoying. Hello, fat boy. Now, they look really, like, scary, but they're not really. As long as you've got that, which is the shrink ray, you can kill me one hit. They're basically some of the commanders of the alien forces. I think they're called assault commanders. Turret down. Don't use that, I'll just work on them. Boom. Go up here. We press that. Uh, we can go through here. Come get some. Come get some. Pick up a hollow duke, which are always handy. I never really used them though, but if I started using them, you'd see how useful they were. And damn it! I had one of them horrible things spawn. I don't know where it came from, but it didn't get me. So we win. God, that is a right view. I love it. Right, now there's a secret here. No, ah, no, I don't think so. Now the secret is acquired in a kind of long way, really. Now. 
Hold on, I've got to remember how to get to it now. There's a switch somewhere. Where is it? Ah, there it is. Right. So that is a switch there, folks, that we need to hit to open a secret door. Now, to open it, and to make sure we do it in time, the best bet is to shoot it from here. Then very quickly, run through here. Open this. Go in this lift. I'll use the shrinker a bit in here, I think. Looks like I have the gun. Looks like you have the what? The gum. Anyway, if you don't recognise it, folks, this is the very cool recreation of the Enterprise Bridge. Yes, I kid you not, this is actually in Duke Nukem. How awesome is that? kick now. Damn you. Anyway, this is the cap- Oh, fuzz you, man! Uh. This is the captain's ready room. Even complete with a fish tank. Mm. 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 However, there is one more secret in here. Oh, yes. The really ready room. So, this is what Picard was doing all those episodes when he went into his well, supposedly innocent ready room, he went into the really ready room. I know that's not canon, but it's funny to think that it was. I actually love The Next Generation, for the record. We could really do with a, bit, a few more shotgun shells, quite honestly. I think we're pretty much done here. Yeah, two for one deal. Get in. Now I think that that force field is down, so if we run quickly through that electricity, you can't run through there without getting hurt. Or in that bit, apparently. And that is, folks, another level complete. God, I took 20 minutes on my last go. Bloody hell. 